What, What is up, everyone? Welcome to Candle Play. Hello, good hearts and God sense. My name is Simon, Good Heart BA, and welcome to our channel Canva Play. We make videos here in Canva Play to share Canva design tutorials, tips, tricks, and hacks that will elevate your Canva skills for free. If you are new here, be sure to subscribe and turn on your notifications just below this video so you don't miss out on every video we post here as we upload new videos all the time. Alright then! Let me start our today's tutorial. In today's tutorial, I am going to show you how to create a torn paper hole effect in Canva. The torn paper hole outbound effect is a visual effect that can be applied to images. It creates the illusion of a torn hole in the image with the torn edges curling outwards. This effect can be used to add a creative touch to images, making them look more interesting and dynamic. It is often used in graphic design, advertising, and other visual arts. By applying this effect, images can be made to look as though they are popping out of the page, adding depth and dimensionality to the overall design. Let's get into Canva and I will show you how to create a torn paper hole effect. But before that, here is the design that I will create. I am now in a blank Canva design page and let's create a design. To start, get your subject image from photos or uploads. For this tutorial, I will get mine from photos. And I will type in the search bar the keyword Funny Nerd Man Wearing eyeglasses and bow hit enter you will see here so many options to choose from let me scroll down to find the perfect image for me to use this one showing you the keyword funny man wearing eyeglasses I chose this photo because of its vibe. When you look at it, the man portrays a funny character but formal looking at the same time. In addition, the colors are light and pleasing to the eyes. Therefore, I will click it and use it in the design. Before we start creating the design, let me first color the background yellow. Select the background and hover your mouse on the color tile above here. Click this, and you can now select the preferred color you want. The next thing to do is to remove the background of our subject image. Let's select this image, go to Edit Photo, and as you can see here, I'm using the new photo editor in Canva, but I want to use the old photo editor. So what you will do is hover your mouse here, the bottom part, and I will click here. Revert to old photo editor. Now I will go again here in edit image. And I will click on background remover. Once the background is removed, click Apply. After that, duplicate this subject image. 
and select them. Go to the position button at the top bar and position them middle center. Now we're ready to apply the shadow effect. Let's click this one. And then go to edit image. Scroll down and find shadows. Click see all. And you will see here so many options to choose from. I will use the drop shadow effect. I will click it once more to see the controls and I will adjust the following settings to the position should be in bottom right, offset, change it to 5, angle, remain as 0, transparency, change it to 25, blur, change it to 19, and the color should remain black. Once done, click Apply. Perfect! Now we will search the realistic torn paper hole overlays inside Canvas Photos library. The next step to do is to go to Photos again and type in here in the search bar the keyword Torn Paper Hole. Hit enter and you will see here so many options to choose from. I will scroll down to find the perfect element that I'm going to use for my design. This one. I will show you the keyword. It says here untitled. By the way, this is a free element, so feel free to use it. I will click it and use it in the design. Finding keywords is hard and time-consuming, and you need to do a depth search and a lot more time to find this kind of keyword. If you want to save time and find all the overlays, action brushes, special photo collections, photo series patterns, textures, and mockups in Canva, in just one ebook, we have created an ebook called Canva Bus Book. Canva Bus Book is an ebook of Canva search keywords with visual presentations that will make your designs look great and professional in less time. We have shared in this ebook all the secret collection keywords we used here in Canva Play and even the new ones which are not easily searched inside Canva. So, what are you waiting for? Grab your copy now. Find the link to the product in the description below this video. Going back, I will now select this overlay and I will resize it to occupy the whole page. Drag it from its corners. Then, I will make sure that it really occupies the page. I'll position it middle center and then I will lock it. We're getting there to proceed. We will do some trick to make the person looks like he popped out of the paper hole. Select the images at the back. Click the position button. And go to the layers tab here. And as you can see here, we have two images selected or highlighted because we select them. Then, drag them at the topmost part to position them at the front layer, like this. Now, we will resize these images and position them properly in the whole area. Make sure that the head of the man is sticking outside the torn hole edges. 
Watch me do it. Here is the cool part. Let's select this one. And position it. Let's go to the Arrange tab to back. And as for the other one with the Applied Shadow, we will crop it upward just like this. Perfect. It's now already good with me. Done. This is now the final look of the design I created using the torn paper hole effect in Canva. That's it. For more design inspirations, watch this. If you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and to be updated with our upcoming videos, click subscribe. Drop your comments below for the tutorial you want to learn next time. Before I end this video, I hope I inspire your creativity. I'm Simon, Good Heart VA saying sharing is caring. In behalf of Pinky Godsent VA, thank you for watching this till the end. Don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you don't miss the next video with another exciting Canva tutorial. Bye guys, see you in the next video.